Hallelujah, hallelujah. Come on, let's give it up for what the Lord has been doing throughout this week. If you are ready to worship and praise the Lord, let me see you on your feet. Let me see you begin to lift your voice, to raise your hands, because our God is worthy of praise. He is worthy of worship. God, we thank you for what you've been doing in this place, for what you've been doing in our lives. God, we thank you for the revelation that we have in Jesus Christ. We thank you, Lord, that we have been gifted and privileged to be alive in this time, to be in this ground, to be in this house, to hear your word, to receive from your spirit. God, there is no other place we'd rather be than to be right here in your house and to be right here in your presence. God, we surrender completely to you. God, we give you our lives. We give you our hearts. We are completely open to you, Jesus. We are here for no other reason but for Jesus Christ. We are here to lift up our voice for no other person but for Jesus Christ. We give all the glory. We give all the honor. We give all the praise. I can search, but I will never find anyone like Jesus Christ. I can search the world, but I could never find someone to save me like Jesus. Someone who loved me like Jesus. Someone who would give his life for me like Jesus. Lord, we worship you in this place. We praise your holy name because there is no one like you. There is no one above you. There is no one beside you. You are the beginning. You are the end. You are the first. You are the last. You are the Alpha and Omega. Do you know the God you worship? Do you know the God you serve? Do you know the name you proclaim? Do you know the one we lift up? Oh, hallelujah. I know who I came to worship. I know who I came to see. I know who I came to experience. His name is Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, if you're tuning in online, if you're in the overflow, just know it's the same Holy Spirit all around. He's right here with each and every one of us. Amen.
And who else can lead us, lead us to freedom? No one, no one, no one. And who else can heal all our sins and diseases? No one, no one, no one. And who else can walk, walk on the waters? No one, no one, no one. And who else can answer, answer my fire?
like Jesus. Can't nobody love me like Jesus. Nobody, nobody. It's a narrow road 
that leads to life and I want to be on it it's a narrow road but your mercy is wide cause you're good on your promise I'll take I'll take you where you are if you say is always enough and you said your heart would never forget no forsake me you said i'm safe you call me up you said my future is full of your hope you never fail so i know i know that you'll never sing you said your love Even in my weakness, you said your heart. I know 
trust only in you we rest in your promise 
We rest in your promise, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 There's no one like it, Jesus. No hay nadie como tu Señor. You are worthy. You are worthy. Tu eres digno. Tu eres digno. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Worthy of every song we could ever sing. Worthy of all the praise we could ever bring. You're worthy of every breath we could ever breathe. We live for you. Jesus, the name above every other name. Jesus, the only one who could ever save me. You are worthy of every breath we could ever breathe. We live for you. We live for you, Lord. Let's sing holy. Holy. There is no one like, there is none beside. Open up my eyes in wonder and show me who you are and fill with your heart and lead me with your love to those around me. sing worthy worthy of every song we could ever sing you're worthy of all the praise and worthy of all the praise we could ever sing. you alone are worthy of my breath worthy of every breath we could ever breathe. we live for you only for you Lord cause you're the name above all names Jesus the name above every other Jesus the only one Jesus the only one who could ever sing is why you're worthy Jesus worthy of every breath we could ever forever I will live, live for you, you. declare we live for you we sing holy
will put my trust in you alone.
up your voice in praise. Lift up your voice in worship. If you know who you worship, he is all and no man. Forever you work, forever you work. For from him and through him and to him are all.
For the brethren, the children of God to join together in the presence of the living God. There is no better place to be. Better is one day than a thousand elsewhere. Nothing compares than to be in the presence, the presence of the living God. That when he enters the room, when his glory descends, the atmosphere changes and anything can happen. When the atmosphere is right, anything can happen when the heavens are open, when His presence is here. Oh Lord, we know we need your presence. Hallelujah. your presence God it is your presence we reverence it is your presence we worship it is your presence where we want to be where we want to rest we don't want to go into a promised land without your presence Jesus oh we worship you Jesus oh inhabit the praises of your children The atmosphere is changing now For the Spirit of the Lord is here The evidence is all around That the Spirit of the Lord is already here The atmosphere is changing now that the spirit that the spirit of the lord is here i can see it all around me the evidence is all around that the spirit of the lord is here overflowing this place fill our hearts with your i 
We're desperate for you, Jesus. We can't live a single day without your breath. You're like the air that we breathe. You're like the breath in my lungs. Without you, I know I can make it. Without your presence in me, Jesus. Without your presence in me, Lord. Yeah. Say 
Thank you in the name of Jesus, your only son, for the privilege to be in your presence. Father, glorify yourself even now. Cleanse us and purify us of every unrighteousness. May we be able to receive the grace that you have ordained for us. May we receive the mercy you have made available for us. Reveal yourself even now, my Lord and my God. In the name of your son, Jesus, show yourself again amongst us. Show yourself amongst us again, O oh Lord. Help us to be everything you want us to be. In the name of your son, Jesus Christ. And everybody said... And everybody said... Clap your hands to the King of Kings. Clap your hands to the Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Touch your neighbor, say the Lord is good. The Lord is good. Find your neighbor, tell them the Lord is good. The Lord is good. Touch your neighbor, say you shall see the goodness of God. You shall see the goodness of Tonight God. Tonight is the night you will experience the goodness of God. Tonight is the night you will experience the goodness 
the goodness of God will follow you all the days of your life. The goodness of God will follow you all the days of your life. You will see the goodness of God in the land of the living. You will see the goodness of God in the land of He will reveal himself unto you. He will reveal himself. He will show himself unto you. He will show himself unto you. Something is about to change in your life tonight. Something is about to change. If you believe it, shall glory. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Look at your neighbor. Say neighbor. 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 Faith is the act of expectation. Faith is, is the act, act of expectation. expectation. I can hear you. Faith is the act of expectation. I can hear you. Faith is the act of expectation. Anyone that cannot expect cannot receive. Anyone that cannot expect cannot receive. Now hear me by the Spirit of God. If you speak to God and you tell God your desire, you tell God what you are crying for, what you're waiting for. If you lack faith, you're not praying. Amen. And the faith says, I am expecting that what I have spoken, I have received. Amen. Hallelujah. That is why the Bible says it like this. If you pray, believe. And you have it. It did not say when you pray, wait for manifestation. Amen. Uh, You didn't hear what I said. Yes. The manifestation is the expectation. Amen. Let me explain to you something. Whenever... You are expecting something, you make room for it. Amen. Uh, you didn't hear what I said. Yes. Whenever you are expecting something, you do what? You make, make room. room. For it. If you have a house and you're expecting a table, you will clear things to fit in the table. Yes. If you have a home and you're preparing for something, you will clear and make space available yes. for whatever you're expecting to bring in. If you have no parking lot, you can't add more cars. Yes. But if you're going to have more cars, you need a bigger lot. So you need to, the expectation makes you prepare. Yes. Yeah. Amen. So some of you pray without expectation. It means you have not created room for it. Come on. I'm Hallelujah. talking to the wrong people. Hallelujah. Maybe I'm talking to overflow. Where are you overflow? Let me see the overflow people. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus', Jesus mighty name. name. So anyone that cannot expect has not made room. That is what the Bible says it like this. Try me now. If I will not open what? The windows of heaven. And I will pour out a blessing that you will not have room enough what? To receive. It means your expectation will be surpassed by God. So you will not have room to... Hallelujah. 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 Uh, you, You see your shout says you don't know. What I just said to you. If I know God is about to make me a billionaire, I will will start preparing for things billionaires do. I I just prophesied to somebody. If I know God is about to make me a millionaire, I will adapt the attitude of people who are millions. That means I am expected for something to... Your shout is too small. Your shout is your expectation. You are saying, Father, I am ready, I am ready, I am ready, I am ready. Somebody shout fire. So this is the issue now. Are you hearing what I'm saying? Yes. That is a problem. Your expectation is the room. Your expectation is the room. Mm. Even though God will outdo you Mm. because he's able to do exceedingly abundantly. The point is God will outdo you. So it means the farther you stretch it, he will still do more. So the issue is not you stretching because he will surpass it. Amen. So never think what you're asking God is too big. Amen. Because where your thoughts end is where his word begins. Hallelujah. So if you say, Lord, I'm expecting this, just know he will stretch your limits. After that blessing, you'll be ready for a bigger blessing. 
Lift your right hand to heaven. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, in the name of Jesus. Increase my expectation. Increase my expectation. Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, in the name of Jesus. Increase my capacity to expect. Increase my capacity. Lift your voice and begin to pray. Lift your voice and begin to pray. Father, I can hear you pray. Lift your voice. Lift your voice. Lift your voice. Lift your voice. Clap your hands to the Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Grab your Bibles quickly, as quickly as you can. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Daniel chapter 3, verse 3 to 14. We are going to read this with the speed of lightning so that we can minister and, and, and minister to everybody so that everybody can be touched by God. We can pray and believe God for the impossible. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Are you ready? Yes. yes. Are you ready? Yes. Uh, I want to welcome Revelation Nation everywhere in the world you are. May the Lord bless you, increase you. Amen. Today we will see the hand of God in a different way. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 Are you ready? Yes. yes. One, two, three. Then, then the, the princes, princes, the governors, the, governors, and the captains, captains, the judges, the treasurers, the counselors, the sheriffs, and all the rulers of the provinces were gathered, gathered together unto the dedication of the image of Nebuchadnezzar the king had set up. And they stood before the image that Nebuchadnezzar had set up. 
Then, then an herald cried aloud, To you, you it is commanded, O people, nations, and languages, that at what, what time ye hear the sound of the cornet, flute, harp, sackbut, psaltery, dulcimer, and all kinds of music, ye fall down and worship the golden image that Nebuchadnezzar the king hath set up. And whoso falleth not down and worshipeth shall the same hour be cast into the midst of a burning fiery furnace. Therefore, at that time, when all the people heard the sound of the cornet, flute, harp, sackbut, psaltery, and all kinds of music, all the people, the nations, and the languages fell down and worshipped the golden image that Nebuchadnezzar the king had set up. Wherefore, at that, that time, certain Chaldeans came near and accused the Jews. They spake and said to the king Nebuchadnezzar, O king, live forever. Thou, O king, hast made a decree that every man that shall hear the sound of the cornet, flute, harp, sackbut, psaltery, and dulcimer, and all kinds of music, shall fall down and worship the golden image. And whoso falleth not down and worshipeth, that he should be cast into the midst of a burning, fiery furnace. There are certain Jews whom thou hast set over the affairs of the province of Babylon, Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego. These men, O king, have not regarded thee. They serve not thy gods, nor worship the golden image which thou hast set up. Then Nebuchadnezzar, in his rage and fury, commanded to bring Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, then they brought these men before the king. Nebuchadnezzar spake and said unto them, Is it true, O Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego? Do not ye serve my gods, nor worship the golden image which I have set up? Uh, 13, 14. Hey, Auntie Benz. One more time. I want you to read it with everything because I want you to understand what is being said. Amen. Some of you don't like to read Bible. Touch your neighbor, say, read the word of God. Read, read the, the word, word of God. God. You need to read the word of God. You need, you need to, to read, read the, the word, word of God. God. For real, for real. For real, for real. The word of God is life. The, the word, word of God, God is life. And the word of God is a sword. The, the word, word of God, God is a sword. So read it for real, for real. So read, read it for real, for real. So when you read the word of God, read with everything because you're engaging with something supernatural. Amen. Amen. Are you hearing me? Yes. One, two, three. Then the princes, the governors, and captains, the judges, the treasurers, the counselors, the sheriffs, and all the rulers of the provinces were gathered together unto the dedication of the image that Nebuchadnezzar the king had set up. And they stood before the image that Nebuchadnezzar had set up. Then a herald cried aloud, To you it is commanded, O people, nations, and languages, that at what time ye hear the sound of the cornet, flute, harp, sackbut, psaltery, dulcimer, and all kinds of music, ye fall down and worship the golden image that Nebuchadnezzar the king hath set up. And whoso falleth not down and worshipeth shall fall the same hour be cast into the midst of a burning fiery furnace. Therefore, at that time, when all the people heard the sound of the cornet, flute, Harp, sackbut, psaltery, and all kinds of music, all the people, the nations, and the languages fell down and worshipped the golden image that Nebuchadnezzar the king had set up. Wherefore, at that time, certain Chaldeans came near and accused the Jews. They spake and said to the king Nebuchadnezzar, O king, live forever. Thou, O king, hast made a decree that every man that shall hear the sound of the cornet Flute, harp, sackbut, psaltery, and dulcimer, and all kinds of music shall fall down and worship the golden image. And whoso falleth not down and worshipeth, that he shall be cast into the midst of a burning fiery furnace. There are certain Jews whom thou hast set over the affairs of the province of Babylon, Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego. These men, O king, have not regarded thee. They serve not thy gods, nor worship the golden image which thou hast set up. Then Nebuchadnezzar, in his rage and fury, commanded to bring Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego. Then they brought these men before the king. 
Nebuchadnezzar spake and said unto them, Is it true, O Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego? Do not ye serve my gods, nor worship the golden image which I have set up? You may sit in heavenly places. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Now, I'm going to preach this as quickly as I can because I want us to pray. Uh, especially that we haven't been live. We've been doing prophetic school, so we need to, to enter into prayer. <laughs> Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Uh, listen, the Dreaming Prophets was probably my favorite prophetic school so Amen. far. Amen. Amen. That was, uh, was different. Amen. I can't wait for the next one. Amen. And I can't wait. Is it Friday that we're doing the other thing? Tomorrow. It's going to be good. God is uh, glorified. Now, I want you to hear me by the Spirit of God because it is very important to understand that everything in life operates with a rhythm. Mm. There is a rhythm that runs everything. And when that rhythm is broken is when things become abnormal. When you look at waves of the sea, there is a certain flow they will go with. Whenever the waves get wild, whereby chaos is going to happen, the rhythm breaks. Your own heartbeat has a tempo. And if that tempo drops or it goes faster, something is wrong with you. Your blood has a certain rhythm that it goes with. If it goes low or fast, something is off. Even life itself has a specific rhythm that Satan himself knows that in order to destroy you, he has to change what makes you dance or move. So in life you will find that depending on the era and the time you're in, people were dancing to a different rhythm. Music sounded different. How people dressed looked different. You can tell the era and the time simply by the sound of the music, the tempo of the music, or how people dressed. It is a rhythm that life creates that you can identify, oh, this is the 70s, this is the 80s, this is the 90s, the 2000s. You can tell simply by the era, by the sound, and the tempo that everything is going by. Now, unfortunately, many of us as children of God, have simply regarded the rhythm that is played in the world to mean looking like the world. You see, when God looks at you, he says you are in the world but not of it. But those who are not spiritual, they think it means don't look like the people in your time. But that is not what God is talking about because if you are a human in 1968... You will dress like 1968. Yeah. I don't know if somebody is understanding what I'm saying. Yeah. There is no way you can avoid how to look like 1968 because every designer, every cloth that is being made is being made for that era. That is the vision of the people of the time. So what is really dancing to the rhythm or the wrong song of your era? You have to understand that when spiritual beings look at you and they look at me, they don't look at what we say. They look at the rhythm that we are moving in. Mm, that's good. Oh, I'm going somewhere now a little dangerous. That's good. Whenever spirits look at you, they don't observe what you say. That is why God can hear your heart before you say anything because God is not waiting for what you will say. He is always testing the hearts of men because there is something that you create that tells God you are speaking to him. I don't know if somebody is understanding this. Yes. Now, you have to understand like many times when something is wrong with somebody, we would say, what is the matter? Because you can feel something is off. You can't see it, but you can tell something is uh, in the air is not right. There is a tension, there is something, and you say, what is the matter? Now, you have to understand what matter is. Matter is a scientific word, meaning what is the substance you're creating. That's good. So when spiritual beings are looking at you, they are looking at what you're creating. There is a sound you're creating spiritually. Ooh, uh, 
There is a rhythm that you're creating spiritually that will determine who will come to you. Amen. Oh, I feel like I'm talking to myself. You're teaching, you're teaching. So when they observe you, they are not just looking at what you're saying. If you look at demons, you don't know the nature, you don't identify the nature of a devil by what they say. Because a devil can come as an angel of light. A devil can say the right things. A devil can quote the Bible to you. But what will show you that is a devil? There is a rhythm and a pattern Come on. that demons have. They cannot break whether they like it or not. Come on. That is what identifies them to be devils. What does the Bible say? They have no rest. Mm. So even though they say good things, there is a sense of no rest mm. that is always with them. So by that itself, you can identify this is not an angel from God. This is an evil spirit. Why are you always sounding like there's an agency? You want to push me to do something? You know this is a devil. Because whenever it is an angel, they come to announce rest. Mm. I feel like I'm Hallelujah. talking to myself. Amen. You're teaching. So spiritual things are not discerned, discerned by what is being said. There is a pattern. That is why even God himself, to know him, you don't identify God by what he said. Because God can say a harsh thing, but it is for your salvation. Amen. So if you're waiting for something that will make you feel good to think it is God, you will lose God. But how do you know that it is God? There is a pattern that God has. Amen. Jeremiah was praying, Father, show me your ancient paths. He didn't say, show me your words. He said, show me your ways. What is your pattern? Many times when God wants to bless you, Chaos will overtake you. Mm. But on. if you don't know that it is God that is involved, you will start rebuking the devil, not understanding that God is working something out yes. for your good. Amen. I, I don't know if somebody can hear me. Yes, yes. When God says, I will bless you, you have to prepare yourself for the greatest drought that is about to come. Ooh. Because after that drought, then the blessing that will come Hallelujah. Will make you forget of every pain, every tear come on. you have ever cried. Come on. Because that drought won't come to kill you. That drought will come to weed out everything that will eat your harvest. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I feel like I'm talking to myself. Hallelujah. So whenever God is trying to bless his people, there is a pattern. When Moses was sent into Egypt, he went to the Pharaoh and told the Pharaoh, the God of our fathers have appeared unto us. And he has said, let my people go to go and worship me on the mountain that I have set. Instead of Pharaoh hearing God's word, the same God who said, go and tell Pharaoh to let my people go, was the same God that made Pharaoh more stubborn. Yes. Yes. Oh, you didn't hear what Come I on. said. Come on. It is the same God that made the heart of Pharaoh difficult to obey Moses. Yes. Pharaoh looked at Moses and said, listen, because this your God is, is, is too great, you're saying I, I should let you guys go. I am going to make your labor worse. The Egyptians usually gather these things for you to make bricks. This time you yourselves are going to gather it. Yes. So the people who are excited for the message of deliverance were the same people that looked at Moses and said, Moses, go back to your God. You said that he has sent you to free us. No, you have come to add our problems. Yes. You have come to multiply our problems. Yes. Notice, God tried them by hardening the heart of Pharaoh to see if they will still dance to Pharaoh or they will adapt a song of freedom. Hallelujah. Come on. I feel like I'm talking Hallelujah. to the wrong people. Whenever God comes to you, he releases a song to you. Hey. But that song will be tested by the location that you are in. The spirit in that territory will also play his song. And if you don't dance to his song, there will be a consequence. When the scandemic, sorry, the pandemic, the, sorry, the... The pandemic started. 
most people, most people, most people danced to a false song of God. Everybody wanted God. But it was not a real song. It was a hypocritical song. Because when they were told you can't go and pray, most people did not want to go out and pray. They were afraid. And there is nothing wrong with being unsure or uncertain because it was a real disease. It killed some people. I know people that were killed by it. It is true. But many other people began to listen to the voice of Nebuchadnezzar. Sorry. The <laughs> you started running your life not according to God's word. Fear gripped people that are Holy Ghost filled. That the world started looking and saying, why should we believe your God? You yourself, you are afraid just like me. Yes. There was a different song the whole world danced to. Very specific people were never dancing to the rhythm. There's no problem if you vaccinated, you didn't vaccinate. That's your own prerogative. But the point is this. Everyone was forced into something that other people also forced other people. Even believers did the same thing. Why? Because there was a song that was played. Everyone was forced to dance. Are you hearing what I'm saying? Yes. What I'm trying to explain to you is that whenever God wants to increase you, there will be a challenge that will rise. The challenge will be, this is what everyone else is doing. Why are you going to be different? Mm. What you want to achieve has taken people 50 years. Yes. Why do you think you're going to do it in one week? Yes. Yes. I, I feel like I'm... Come on, come on. You'll be tried. God said, you, I will make for you a way where there is no way. But everyone else is saying, everyone that went on this path failed. They died. God will say, I will take you to a foreign land. I will make you great. But everyone else will say, ah, we came to this land. We suffered. What makes you think you'll be any different? Just go ahead and do what everyone else does. Notice, the world always wants you to go by a rhythm of failure, not a rhythm of success. Mm, that's good. Because whenever God wants you to be blessed, he will break the pattern of the rhythm that everybody else Hallelujah. has danced to. Hallelujah. There is some of you, you believe, I just have to work day and night to survive. That is not the pattern of, or, or the dance God ordained for you. I feel like I'm talking to myself. Amen. Some of you don't know what it is to enjoy life again. All you think of is survival. Yet Jesus came so that you may have life and life more abundantly. Yes. But because you have seen your mother suffer, your father suffer, your ancestors suffer, you yourself, you just consider yourself a misfortunate person. Even me, I will suffer. Let me just prepare myself mm. to suffer. Yeah. You adapt a song that is not a song that God has given you. Mm. Come on. I feel like I'm talking to myself. You're teaching too good. If God is going to deliver you, he doesn't begin by giving you deliverance. He gives you a song. Mm. Mm. This is why some of you, before you are blessed, the devil will try to quench you praising God. You will look at your life. God is saying, I'm about to increase you. You look at your life and you say, but there is no reason to praise God. Why should I praise God? Everything is going wrong. Everyone is doubting me. Everyone is looking down on me. What does it matter if other people look down on you when God is lifting you? Hallelujah. Why does it matter if everyone doubts you but God believes in you? Yes. What does it matter if everybody rejects you but God receives you? Yes. Is your success with men or is your success with God? Come on. Which song are you dancing to? Amen. Uh, ask your neighbor, say neighbor. Neighbor. 
neighbor. Huh? What song are you dancing to? What, what song, song are, are you dancing, dancing to? Are you dancing to the wrong song? Are you dancing, dancing to, to the, the wrong, wrong song? song? Whenever God announces something, hear me by the Spirit of God. Mm. The Lord will always announce what He's going to do. Mm. Because He just gave you a title of a song. Uh, let me talk Hallelujah. to Overflow. Overflow, hear me. Hallelujah. You're Whenever prophet. God wants to bless the overflow, not this sanctuary, that sanctuary. Yes. Church is an overflow. God will give you a title to see what song you will sing. Amen. He will give you a title. That is what the Bible says. Let the weak say, I am strong. Why is he giving you a title, I am strong? Because the more you sing that song, you shift your dimension. Hallelujah. You come out of the rhythm of weakness. When people are weak, they become very defensive. There is an aura that they carry. There is a song that they sing. There's a mannerism that they have. Whenever people are rejected, there is a rhythm they dance to. Everyone is a suspect because they may drop you next week. So there is a song that they sing without opening their mouth. You can just notice them. Mm, the rhythm is off here. Yes, yes. But when God comes, he will give you good tidings. Jesus came and said this. The spirit of the Lord is upon me, for he has anointed me. Anointed me To what? Preach the gospel to the poor. To heal the brokenhearted. Jesus came with a title. He preached to the people in the synagogue. Close the Bible, put it away. They all looked at him and said, what wonderful words. But who does he think he is to say these words? Jesus looks at them and says, what I have said has been fulfilled in your ears. The problem is when Jesus said, you are healed, they failed to dance. Oh. There is a song playing in your ears. I, I feel like I'm talking to myself. Hallelujah. There is a song playing in your ears. Yes. There is a song of breakthrough. There is a song of increase. Yes. There is a song of elevation. Yes. There is a song of transformation. Hallelujah. But when the song comes to your ears, will you start singing it? Jesus. Or will you stay quiet? Come on. Come on. Shadrach and Abednego, Shadrach, Meshach and Abednego are in trouble. Yeah. Paul and Silas are in jail. Instead of them having prayer points, God releases a song in their spirit. Yes, yes. Come on. At an hour they need deliverance. God is not sending an angel. God sends a song. Yes. They're in prison. They can no longer contain themselves. Come on. They begin to dance. The prison could no longer hold them. Hallelujah. Prison doors be... I am prophesying to somebody. Hallelujah. If you dance the right song... Poverty cannot hold you. Yes. Cancer cannot kill you. Yes. Yes. Something will change. Yes. Uh, hallelujah. A song dropped in them. Yes. They began to dance a different. In the middle of the night, everybody is saying, shh, mm. quiet. Don't you know the time? Do you understand what time it is? Don't you know that this is not the time you praise God? This is the time you, you sleep. Mm. You're going to be killed in the morning. Just try to sleep at least. <laughs> your problems are so much. Just sleep and forget your troubles. Mm. When you are in the most trouble, that is the time to look at a song. Hallelujah. What is the new song I will sing unto the Lord? Yes. yes. Notice what the Bible says. There are two dimensions of song. Let me cover them quickly. Sit for two seconds. I'm about to finish so that we can pray. There are two kinds of songs that will be released. Touch your neighbor say there are two kinds of songs. There are two kinds of songs. I can hear you. There are two kinds of songs. I can hear you. There are two kinds of songs. Shake your neighbor say neighbor there are two kinds of songs. Neighbor there are two kinds of songs. That come by the spirit of God. That come by the spirit of God. The first kind of song will be that God will give you a song. Yeah. There are times that God will, him himself, 
will send you a song. That is why sometimes you wake up. You're minding your own business. You just hear in your spirit. Get out, get out, get out. Get out of the right grave. Hey. Mm, get, mm, that song, I'm feeling it right. Notice, the spirit of God just sent you a song. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Or you'll be minding your own business. Come on. You just start feeling like you need to praise God. Yes. But you don't know why. But you have to understand, whenever praise breaks out of you, it is because in the spirit something has happened. Your Hallelujah. inner man is aware of it. Yes. But your soul doesn't know. So the Holy Spirit sends a song into you. Come on. So a song begins to play. Yeah. But your soul begins to question, mm, why is this song playing in my heart? Yes, Instead yes. of joining the... Ah, come on. There is a whole band playing in the spirit. The angels celebrating, Hallelujah. seeing what God has done. Hallelujah. But you are not aware, you're just there. Woo! There are times you're minding your own business. You have no idea that your spirit went and visited God, sat with God. Because in that moment... You just feel a deep desire to just say you are holy. Yeah. Father, there is no one like you. Wow. God just kissed you, hugged you, sat you by him. Ooh. He's comforting your spirit, but you are... Hallelujah. I'm Too preaching good. to the wrong people. Let me preach to the people online. Something is being communicated to your spirit. But you are not aware because you are too soulish. Ah. So the only way your soul will identify what is happening, there are signals that will be sent to it. So your soul reacts. Mm. Why do I feel like just praising God? Or why do I feel like just worshipping God? Those who are spiritual, they will stop. Oh Father, you are worthy of all praise. Your word, you notice yourself studying. Hey, there is no notice those songs will always come in what you call inconvenience time. Teachers, in times you shouldn't be singing those songs, in times you shouldn't be receiving those songs. Yes, when you are praying, those songs won't necessarily come. It is at an off time you're driving or you're stressed or you're thinking of something or you're even about to do something wrong. The right song comes. Wow. Hallelujah. I don't know if you can hear me. Then there is what they call prophetic song. A prophetic song doesn't come from God. A prophetic song comes from you. Because already in you, you understand the outcome of the situation that you're in. Yes. You know that God did not bring you this far to leave you here. Yes. Come on. So when things look like there is limitation, yes. you know there is a song you need to sing. Yes. 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 God won't come and give you that song. You will create that song. Yes. Yes. That is what the Bible says. Sing a new song unto the Lord. Woo! You are the one who will tell God no. Mm. Maybe God brought you to this place to see if you're ready, you are mature enough. Right. You get to that place, you realize, I used to think five million is a lot of money, but now I'm realizing the projects I want to do. Five million is small. Amen. He's taking me to a wealthy place. Yes. My father owns all the silver. You start singing, you start. Come on, you're teaching properly. You start realizing that you change the narrative because you have matured beyond the faith that was given unto you. You are ready to enter into another dimension. Yes, amen. Some of you, you have allowed the doctor to make you sing a song. Some of you have allowed society to make you sing a song. Some of you have allowed your haters to make you sing a song. That every time 
you find yourself having to think of them. They just put a, they just put a record player in you and they put it on repeat. Like a broken record. Mm, failure. Mm, failure. It keeps playing. Instead of taking that record, breaking it, yes. putting a new song in. Yes. Come on. Yes. Come on. Hallelujah. I feel like I'm talking to myself. But how do you dust off your record player? Mm. Teach us. For a new song, for you to start playing new songs. Yes. Because there are some of you right now, you can't even remember the last time you sang a song to God. Jesus. Whenever you are by yourself, all you can do is vent to God. Mm. God, look at what these people have done. God, look at what has happened. God, are you just watching me die? God, are you going to do something? You know what? Anyway, I'm going to heaven, so whatever. Notice. Uh. There is... uh -uh. I'm speaking the truth. Some of you are not honest enough to admit it, but it's true. Psalms chapter 40, from verse 1 to 3. Thank you. Hallelujah. 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 I wait patiently for the Lord. And he inclined unto me and heard my cry. Hmm. He brought me up also out of a horrible pit. Out of, me, of the mere clay. And set my feet upon a rock. And established my goings. He had put a new song in my mouth. Even praise unto God. Notice there is a song he was given. Come on. But now there was another song added that was a praise song. Amen. Many shall see it and fear mm. and shall trust in the Lord. See what? See the song. Wow. Come on. You didn't hear. You're not reading. You're teaching. Hallelujah. He had put a new song in my mouth. Even praise unto our God. Notice, God put a new song in him. And another song came that was a praise song. Unto God. Mm. So there are two songs. He didn't tell you what the song was. That took him out of the pit. That's good. He hid it. That is his own. Mm. But he showed you the song God gave him. Mm. Wow. When the children of, of Israel were supposed to take over Jericho. Did God tell them to pray or sing a song? <laughs> you want breakthrough, you are praying, fasting instead of singing a song. Wow. Come on. You see, you didn't get it. I'm... Wow, wow, wow. Let me talk to overflow. Let me talk to Hallelujah. somebody. That the wall of your millions that has been blocking your millions, your trillions, yes. your breakthrough, your acceleration, your elevation. You don't break those walls by rabba shadaba. You just start singing an annoying song Come on. that will make a demon realize that they cannot enforce a rhythm on you. Hallelujah. Yeah. That you're going to change the rhythm that has made you dance. Yes. God didn't tell them, get a weapon. He just said, follow this high priest seven days. Just worship. When the, when the song really entered their hearts, on the last day when he, the, the, the trumpet sounded, they gave glory. The walls just putu, putu, putu. They took over a city. Without any weapon, with a song. You overcome the enemies come by a song. Oh. Hallelujah. Ah, look at, let me talk to overcome. Yeah. Hallelujah. It is by a song. Yes. Many of you, I'm sorry to say it. You see, the problem is when I say certain things, People like to cut my videos out of context. And it's okay because it makes small people watch. They go and find out the truth that it wasn't that. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Like everybody thinks I said sex before marriage is okay. I never said that. That video has been out for more than a year. Everybody that watched it came out blessed. Yes. Amen. Some Amen. foolish people cut a few seconds to try to create an art. Now they're embarrassed looking silly. They all look silly because they tried to create a song that people should dance to. But they did not know Elias generation song is too loud. Hey. You can't stop it. It has already been sounding 
in the spirit, you can't do anything about it. So hear me. Many of you need to spend more time singing. Your faith will be way more encouraged. When soldiers are going to a battle, do you know what they do? They sing. Because song empowers courage. Yes. yes. When you go to the gym, you, pray, you play the most exciting song to make you overcome the workout that you're going to get into. You play the best song that you can that has energy that, so that when you're in there, you're running your five mile, your three mile. Even when you're tired, the song encourages you and carries you. Yes. Amen. If you go to the gym with the wrong song, you're not going to finish your workout. You're walking out. My heart will go on. Leonardo, try to work out with that. You won't even do one minute. Go do CrossFit with, the, with the, uh, uh, Celine Dion, My Heart Will Go On. See if you finish a workout. It will be the longest one minute of your life. Are you understanding what I'm saying? The wrong song in the wrong atmosphere makes... The, it messes everything up. But if you go to a place where people are supposed to be celebrating... But they are playing a sad song and you come with celebration. Everybody is encouraged. Jesus went to a funeral with a, with a word. The girl is sleeping. But when he went there, he found people with instruments playing the saddest song. Gone too soon. Oh, poor young girl. Jesus is coming saying, she's sleeping. We're going to wake her up. They came with a song that was so sad that ah, she has died. Stop bothering them. Jesus kicked everyone out because the wrong song can kill the rhythm of miracles. Hallelujah. Can kill the rhythm of healing. Yes. Am I communicating to somebody? Yes, yes, yes. The Bible tells you specifically, Jesus told every musician, get out. Yes. No, no, no. Let's go to verse, verse 4. Watch this. Verse 4. Blessed is, the, is that man that maketh the Lord his trust and respected not the proud, no such as turn aside to lies. Notice, when a song comes, you start rejecting lies. I will never make it. That is a lie. That's I am above and not below. Come on. I shall trample over every serpent, every scorpion. Yeah. The yeah. best is still yet to come. Amen. There is something else you... Come Amen. on. What song? David danced a, 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 a dance. With a rhythm that didn't make sense, his clothes were falling off. His wife came and said, what kind of king are you to that? He said, hey, 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 you don't know the song God gave me. When I was rejected, when my father did not want me, yes. when I was poor, yes. when I was sick, when I was divorced, when everybody turned away from me, the Lord carried me. There yes. is a song in me. You may not understand it. Yes. There is a praise in me. You may not understand it. Yes. I know where he took me from. I know where he has brought me. Yes. I know where he is. Am I talking to somebody? Yes. Hallelujah. Here is something you should know as I finish. Here is something you need to know as I finish. When God gives you a song, you will not announce it to your neighbor. Mm, that's good. The song God gives you will always make you look crazy in front of people. Yeah. Hello. Hello. The song God gives you will always make you appear crazy. Yeah. Everyone will look at you like, mm. okay, whatever. <laughs> Who do you think you are? Then when you make it, 
They'll say, oh, that's my boy. That's my... Yeah, we used to hang out Come all the... On. Yo, I watched them. Ninja, where were you? All of a sudden, you know the song I was... Yeah, I was right there. Why didn't you make it with me? Right. Come on. Amen. Come on. Let me tell you something. Rejection is one of the best things that can ever happen to you. Because it will weed out people that were, yes. Amen. were profiting from you. People that will destroy you in the future. If somebody betrays you, it's an advantage. God just removed somebody that was going to be a leech. Drinking your blood, wasting you away. That you are getting broke and you don't know why you're getting broke. Somebody spiritually is stealing your blessing and you don't know. So God will make them act a certain way to reject you. But the problem is many of you, you want their acceptance. But you don't realize when they loved you was when you had something. When God took that thing away to get rid of them, you want to keep them. Not understanding as long as you keep them, a new song cannot come. That's good. Listen, all my life I was overlooked. All my life I was undermined. I, am a, I, am, I should not be here. I should not be here. Anyone who knows my story knows that I should not be here at all. I should never be here. And you can see that the world wants me to dance a certain rhythm. Trust me, I, will, I am just me. Until the day that I will sleep in the presence of God, I will never dance to anybody's rhythm. It is impossible. I have seen God too much. He has given me so many songs over my life that there is no way I will ever dance to something else. You have no idea how many people when God spoke to me, this is what you're going to do. They told me, why would you want to do something so difficult? Why would you want to do this? Why don't you just stay in what you, you, you are so talented. Why did you? Every area of my life fought. But I said, I will not stop dancing to what God gave me. Amen. I know what God showed me. Yes. I know what I felt. I know what I heard. I will not stop. Amen. So many that look at me, they don't know where I came from. So they look at the present person. They don't know how fortified I am. Do you realize you can forget your ABCs, but when you sing them, you remember? Some of you need to change your testimonies into a song. Hallelujah. Amen. Uh, uh, let me find somebody I can talk to. Amen. Let me find somebody I can talk to. You have never sung your song. When the children of Israel walked through the Red Sea, carrying the body of Joseph, whose song did they sing? The Bible tells you they sang a song of somebody. Let me see who reads the Bible. Huh? Whose song? So where, what was that song? They never told you. What did Miriam do for Moses? She fetched him out of the water. She's the one who pushed him through the water and got him to the Pharaoh. That Pharaoh's sister or daughter is the one that picked up Moses. On the, she's the one who did that. That when they picked him up, they called him Moshe, which means one fetched out of water. Their deliverance comes by the same water. Whose song are they going to sing? Wow. Talking to the wrong people. You're teaching. I just spoke to the wrong people. That's so good. I want you to rise up. <laughs> I want you to hear me. Heaven is filled with song. Not with words. Heaven is a land filled with song. Amen. Every approach you ever have to God has to do with a song. Heaven is filled with music, not with words. One cried out. Everything is in song. There is a rhythm that heaven dances to. And when that rhythm enters earth, the atmosphere of heaven also moves on earth. The issue is, you don't understand the world that your God dwells in is full of music. Is full of song. 
Every passage of heaven you hear is people worshiping, singing a song. They don't tell you that song. The only song they've ever told you words is hallelujah. We don't even know what language it is. It's tongues. <laughs> they gave us one lyric. <laughs> they just sing hallelujah, hallelujah. It's not Hebrew. It's not any of our languages. It's a heavenly language. Amen. It's tongues. That's the only thing they say. Okay, let's give them one word at least. Hallelujah. That's what they sing day and night. Why are they sing? Why are these people singing day and night? Why? What you don't understand is this, and I will say this and we'll move on. God does not live in heaven. God is manifested in heaven. Because heaven is a created place. No different than earth. In the beginning, God created the heaven and the earth. Before he created it, where was he? The Bible says Jesus ascended above all heavens so that he may fill all things. Where did he go? Above all. Every heaven that existed, that exists, Jesus went past it all. Where did he go? And where he went, he can fill all things. So where is there, why is there a song in heaven? That is what maintains the frequency of God in that realm. Oh. Notice the moment Satan stopped singing, the moment he start, stopped worshipping, he could no longer exist in that world. He was kicked out. Wow, 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 wow. Many of you are removing yourself from... Oh. Wow. Ah, you missed it. I, I think I spoke to the wrong people. Wow. Satan could not be in that environment. Because he's not flowing with that rhythm. People are going this way. He's going that way. He was rejected. There was no longer place found for him. He was thrown out. He was singing the wrong song. Everybody saying how great God is. How wonderful he is. Me, he started. Look at me. I'm fly. I should be worshipped. Yeah, I need to be like the most high. Ah. So when, when notes are going up, they're like, hey, what is this one? Throw this one out. Kicked him out. So the atmosphere of heaven is maintained by a rhythm and a song. That is why there is worship 24-7. Remember, when Solomon built a temple, one was the, what was one of the main things that made the temple of Solomon different than any other temple that was ever made? When the presence of God came down, there was worship 24-7. And because of the worship, the cloud of God descended that nobody could even stand up. Wow, wow. Notice the same cloud that is seen in heaven appeared with. Right. Come on. It was on earth. The moment Solomon's time went, that practice stopped. Everything lifted. You go to Israel, people are just like. Bah, 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 bah. No cloud, nothing. The rhythm was broken. Wow. Where God is. Where the Lord is, where the spirit of the Lord is, there is liberty. You don't pray for deliverance. Just make him come. Amen. 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 Some of you missed it. I feel like I spoke to myself. Just let him come. His presence. That's it. Let him show up. When he shows up, everything else is automatic. Yes. Mm. Meaning if there are demons in your life, it's because there is a break of rhythm. Mm. Okay, let's pray. I'm sorry. sorry. I said too much. Mm. I want you to lift your right hand to heaven. And you're going to pray that the Lord will revive the song. The songs that he put in you when you are a child, when you are young. To remind you even of the songs that gave you victory. When you are successful, what song did God give you? Now you're going through something that has made you forget that you used to be on top. You are just singing the wrong songs of trying to prove people, to show people. You need to change that. Your race is your own. Your race is not with people. When you succeed, you succeed for you and your family, not for your haters. Your, your haters are already in the dust. That's why they are talking about you. So you don't need to prove anything to anyone. For what? There's nothing to prove to them. 
Are you listening to me, somebody? Yes. I want you to lift your hands to heaven. Tell the Lord, Lord, revive a new song in me. Lift your voice and begin to pray. Begin to tell God to revive a new song in you. Father, revive a new song. Revive the songs that you put in me, O God. Speak to the Lord. Speak to the Lord. Speak to the Lord. Songs of victory. Songs of joy, O God. Songs of liberty, O God. Revive those songs in me, O God. May they ever be present at the forefront of my mind, O God. When I'm going through the situations, O God. Let the songs that you have placed in me arise, O God. Remind me those songs. Let those songs arise. of Jesus Father in the name of Jesus every song from the camp of the enemy every song from the camp of the enemy songs of failure songs of failure songs of death songs of death songs of limitation songs of limitation songs of worry songs of worry songs of anxiety songs of anxiety every sort of song every sort of song that is from the enemy's camp that is from the enemy's camp in the mighty name of Jesus in the mighty name of Jesus let it be cancelled now 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 lift your voice and begin to speak to God every song be destroyed now let it be cancelled in the name of Jesus. Every song of the enemy may it be cancelled. Lift your voice, lift your voice. Lift your voice, lift your voice. Cancel the evil song out of you. Cancel the evil song of the enemy right now. Lift your voice! Lift your voice! Lift your voice! 
to me the chain of evil songs that has played in your family is being cancelled in the name of Jesus Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. what your mother danced to your father danced to your brothers and sisters danced to you shall not dance to it in the name of Jesus Hallelujah. a rhythm from heaven shall carry you Somebody say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. Let the song change. Let, Let the song, song change. change. Let songs of victory come forth. Let, Let songs of victory come forth. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. Hear me. Lift up all your prayer requests, not your giving, sorry. All your prayer requests. Your family members, your business, be it court case, lift it to heaven. The Lord Jesus is able to bless you. The Lord Jesus is able to deliver you. The Lord Jesus is able to change your situation. What man cannot do, Jesus can do. What your strength cannot achieve, Jesus can give it. Our Lord is able to do the impossible. Amen. Are you hearing me? Yes. yes. I can hear your yes. 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 I can hear your yes. Yes. You can give Jesus a better yes. What? Yeah. Lift it to heaven. Father, I decree and declare upon everyone that is here. Those who are watching from home and those who are present. Whatever the situation is in their lives. Be it with their children, be it with their careers, be it with their destinies, be it with those who are sick. Father, today restore them, increase them, and deliver them from the grasp of the enemy. I decree and declare by the power of the Holy Ghost. Let freedom that can only be given by God come upon them. A freedom that cannot be stolen. A freedom that cannot be reversed. A freedom that cannot be changed by the will of men. From today in the name of Jesus. I release you into your liberty. I release you into your miracle. I release you into your breakthrough. I release you into your deliverance. In the mighty name of Jesus. That phone call you have been waiting for. Hey. Yes. That opportunity you have been waiting for. That change you have been waiting for. It is coming now in the name of Jesus. Amen. I receive. That blessing you have been waiting for. That healing you have been waiting for. 
those finances you have been waiting on, yeah. the windows of heaven are open for you. Yeah. Amen. I said the windows of heaven are open for you. Amen. Receive the blessing of God. Receive the blessing of God. The louder the amen, the greater the miracle. Thank you, Jesus. Somebody shout amen. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, in the name of Jesus. My account will never know minus. My account will never know minus. I will know millions upon millions upon millions. I will know billions upon billions upon millions. My body will never know sickness. My body will never know sickness. My body will know supernatural wealth. My body will know supernatural wealth. Supernatural healing. Supernatural healing. Supernatural health. Supernatural health. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Hospitals will not be my portion. Surgery will not be my portion. In the mighty name of Jesus, I open every prison that has caged my family physically and spiritually. Let prison doors be open. In the mighty name of Jesus, from today. From today, from today, from today, increase is my portion. Increase is my portion. Divine protection is my portion. Divine protection is my portion. I will not die prematurely. I will not die prematurely. My children will not die prematurely. My children will not die prematurely. From today, I decree and declare. From today, I decree and declare. Premature death. Premature death will never know my house. Will never know my house. We will fulfill our destinies. We will fulfill our destiny. Everyone that is joined to me by blood. Everyone that is joined to me by blood will not die prematurely. You will satisfy us with long years. You will satisfy us with long years. We will know the goodness of God. We will know the goodness of God. We will be satisfied with good things. We will be satisfied with good things. And our days shall be plenty on the earth and our days shall be plenty on in the earth. mighty name of Jesus. Jesus lift your voice and begin to thank God for the blessing thank you thank you, thank you. Thank you. begin to thank God that it is done thank you for the blessing thank you for the blessing I hear you pray lift your voice lift your voice thank you for the goodness thank you for the blessing thank you for the blessing thank you for the blessing hallelujah hallelujah your hands to heaven I see the cloud of glory resting on you amen, amen. I receive. if you are sensitive in the spirit you will feel it close your eyes close your eyes lift it lift your hands even those who are at home lift your hands godome cinema ane mekida akuria mede beheze trontonte mekida akuba parete didia rebede bede besuta papa te petepe Tepe, 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 tepe. Tepe, 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 tepe. Look at what is happening over there. Tepe, tepe, tepe. Look, 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 look. People on camera, show. Tepe, the cloud, the cloud of glory. Look at what is happening to people. Tepe, 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 tepe. Tepe, tepe, tepe. Tepe, tepe, tepe. Mokonte, mekete de dia, makupa, makupa remene meheze. Zapupa lebede le mekupa le mate le pe zekupetea ramanto toto papa 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 kozo 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 me kozo kozo me meke debe hezuka lato petia 
cloud, cloud, rest on them. Presence of God, rest on them. Glory of God, rest on them. Power of God, rest on them. Presence of God, rest on them. May they take this to their homes. May they take this to their families. May they take this to their children. Presence of God. Presence of God. Leave them, leave them. Presence of God. Cloud of God. Mako. Mekene meheze. Lebende mekupa. Zakori ya mene mehezu. Peria masete. Kanama sute. Lift your hands. Something is dropping on you. Something is dropping on you. Something that is dropping on you. Supernatural from heaven. God is giving you something. The Holy Spirit is giving you something. The same presence in the tabernacle has descended upon you. For the Lord says you are his house and his presence shall go with you. He shall not leave you. He shall not forsake you. You shall see his presence among your children, among your destiny, in everything you do. The cloud is on you. The cloud is on you. Hey! Hey! Look at what is happening. Look at what is happening. Look at what is happening. Hey! 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 Cloud of glory. Muma. Muma me. Muma me. Muma me. Muma me. Muma me. Zekeya. Metelethea, zuprafetea, lidoste mekida akute, rumasete. Heaven's atmosphere, heaven's atmosphere, heaven's atmosphere. Your kingdom come, your will be done. Your kingdom come, your will be done. Oh, our Father, Papa, Papa, Papa. Your kingdom come, your will be done. Your kingdom come, your will be done. Your kingdom come, your will be done on your sons and your daughters. Cloud of glory. Cloud of glory. Look at the presence of God upon people. Oh Jesus. Oh Jesus. Supernatural transformation. Supernatural transformation. Those who are addicts are delivered. Those who have chronic sicknesses are delivered. Those who are in poverty are delivered. Those who are in confusion are delivered. Cloud of glory. Presence of excellence. Oh! oh. Lift your hands to Him. Lift your hands to Him. This is the time to say, Lord, I give myself to you. Holy Spirit, I give myself to you. Possess me, Holy Ghost. Rest upon me, Holy Ghost. Take me over, Holy Ghost. May I never be the same for your glory. Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, may your weight rest on me. May your weight rest on me. May your weight rest on me. Oh Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus, your presence possess me, your presence invade me. Roto to 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 Kede beheza, rimando kotosa, libre fetele mekuta la mahazika teke, ribada ba 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 ba. Rimande de 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 be, rukapa ha, 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 rukapa ha. Those who are believing God for a ministry that is effective, this is the time to receive the presence. Those who want to operate in the prophetic, this is the time to receive the presence of God. This is the time to receive the presence of the Holy Spirit. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Spirit. 
Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, settle your children today. Settle your children today. A higher dimension! Hey! A higher dimension on your children. A higher dimension on your children. A new level on your children. Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, my Father and my God, a new dimension upon this church, a new dimension upon everyone that is here. Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, may we know you afresh, may we know you in a new dimension, may we know you like never before. Do with us what we have never known. Oh, your glory and your presence. Your cloud that has descended upon this house. And upon everybody that is hearing my voice. Father, do a new thing. Do a new thing. Do a new thing. Lift your voice and call on him. Call on him. Call on him. Divine. 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 Momo. Momekete. Limando totia, repete tia, remekusa le make diga akute, mere de 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 dosh, mako remete liga akusa, remende de de be soto, ira mande de de be hezuka mahaliga ate, remende de be hezuka, rata te le mekusa, ramande de be kuze de be hezosa, rimando kotia makete le kisa akota, hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yeso mana mahazika lama. Ozana. Ilio moseteya. Limo sekida ankronos evetete. Limansoni malabaza. Lezo ramana. Inamason de lebeza kara. Izo makuza ila maze ne 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 ze ne ze ne munda diga ze dei bo sente liga limonze kente lida antoronte rita rene me suza na marada romonze deia romonze deia romonze deia rica dosha na mahida Remene so non te di Mendele zuta paradia In grosso ton te diga ako In amase teia Le rose, le rose, le rose, le rose Mendele sende de den de den de den de den Munka diga Rana maso ze de bei Ila maso Ila maso Ila maso, eza na mana mazunane, ezo ne mana. Ila maso ne me kere ba kure amasete de behei, la masede, la masede, la masede, la masede. Ina maso tani ma. Loria son de be 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 kuda Ilia son te meine nia Eloi, 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 Eloi Hashem, Hashem, Hashem Imaku me me, me ne me suta Eloi, Eloi, Eloi Elohi, ino mo se me 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 me, ina ma 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 su udi amase. Elohi, 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 mi kado shamana ma azuta, me ne me suta, liri amaso, oli amakata ba 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 sete. Elohi, 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 Elohi. You have descended from heaven. You have descended from heaven. Elohi, 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 Elohi. You who rides on the wings of the 
cherubims. You have descended upon this house for all your people to see. Elohi, I maku mekeya, aluka pa, zako, hey. angels that are here. Thank you for the cloud that is in this house. That I believe even those who are at home are experiencing it now. Oh, Holy Spirit, be lifted, oh Father. Oh, Father, be lifted. Oh, oh. I love the Lord because he has heard my prayer, my supplication. I love the Lord because he has heard my prayer, my supplication. Therefore, shall I call upon him all the days of my life? I love the Lord because he has heard my supplication. Therefore, shall I call upon him all the days of my life? I love the Lord because he has heard my supplication. Therefore, shall I call
Lift your hands, everyone here. Lift your hands. Lift your hands. Lift your hands to Him. You have been marked by God. Even you who is watching from home, you have been marked by God. As the cloud of God descended, I did not see him yet. Then I saw the two cherubims of God coming out of the cloud and I saw him in the back. There is a life that has been put in us by God that we and our houses will never be the same again. I believe what the Lord has put in us today will carry us even into eternity. Maintain this atmosphere. Maintain this atmosphere. He descended himself. All our prayers are answered today. I said all our prayers are answered today. Hallelujah! Don't allow anyone to change the song you have received. Hallelujah! Don't allow anyone to change what you have experienced. There will be none that will be bound in your house. Amen. Amen. There will be none that will be lost in your house. Amen. Amen. If anyone was lost, they are coming back. Amen. Amen. That which was stolen will be doubled back. Amen. When the Lord comes, He comes not only to bring restoration, He makes all things new. Don't allow this atmosphere to be shifted from you. Mark today's date down. Mark it on your Bible. Write down the time. This is the day that Elohim visited you. Amen. Look at how many people just got free. Look at how many people just received the presence of God. This is the hand of the Holy Spirit. Don't allow your faith to be shaken. What you are suffering with, the season is over. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Whatever was a bondage, that season is over. Hallelujah. Says the spirit of the living God. The season of suffering, the season of tears, the season of confusion, hey. the season of limitation hey. is over in the name of Jesus. Hey. Maintain this. I have been touched also. I have been changed also. Amen. 
all the brokenness in me, God has mended me. Amen. Amen. How much more for you? Amen. Amen. Something has been added on you. Years have been added on you. Amen. The power of the enemy has been broken off you. Whatever you are praying for, just thank God for it. It is done. Hey. Somebody shout thank you, Jesus. Thank, thank you, Jesus. Jesus. Somebody shout thank you, Jesus. Thank, thank you, Jesus. Jesus. Grab what you want to give to God. Lift it up. Lift up your best sacrifice to God. What a mighty visitation. Some of you, this presence will be like electricity when you're sleeping. It will be with you. Amen. No matter where you will go, it will be with you. If he has chosen to come down. May that song continue to play in your heart. Amen. May that song continue to play in your spirit. In the mighty name of Jesus, name. lift what you want to give to the Lord. Say, Father, I honor you. Father, I, honor Father, you. I thank you. Father, I thank you for this mighty visitation. For this mighty visitation. Thank, thank you for what you have done. Thank, thank you for what you have done. Thank you for what you continue to do. Thank, thank you for what you continue. Honor, honor yourself now and eternally. Honor yourself now and eternally. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus', Jesus mighty name. Come and give to God. Come and give to God.
Lord for your visitation. We thank you, Lord, for your visitation. Thank you, Master. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen, amen, amen. Go from this place with this same visitation. Go from this place with this visitation into your homes, into your family, into everything that you do in the mighty name of Jesus. And we'll see you on Sunday. God richly bless you. Remember to invite friends and family. God richly bless you. We love you. Amen.